what's up gang <laughs> happy wednesday um first and foremost shout out like i always gotta shout out my gang shout out to my new subscribers um i've been getting a lot of emails my website is up and running you definitely can reach me at www.magicalflowerstarot.com or you can email, email me at magicalflowerstarot at yahoo.com so first of all y'all have been we I already did a part one to this um this this meg and tory situation so we just gonna we see some new stuff popping up so we're gonna do a quick reading on that um i'm probably gonna do um a shadow reading at the end and y'all see i got my love deck over here so y'all stay tuned we're gonna get into some things so um yeah like i said just shout out to y'all i really want to push a couple of readings out for y'all during the middle of the week because this weekend your girl is going to yay yay oshun's party on friday and then i have something with su on sunday so i love y'all thank y'all for rocking with me i just want to make sure i take care of my gang because i'm getting ready to be busy for a couple of days so let's just get into this right i'm gonna start off by tapping into that energy like i always do Megan, 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 Megan the Stallion, Megan the Stallion, Megan the Stallion, Tory Lanes, Tory Lanes, Tory Lanes, Kelsey, Kelsey, Kelsey. So let's just get up into this. Let me just tap into. First of all, I think I'm gonna just start off with the past energy of Megan the Stallion and Kelsey's relationship. Like, were they already having problems before this? You know, let's just see what that's like. Spirit. Show me the past energy between Megan the Stallion and her best friend, Kelsey. What is the past energy of their friendship? What happened before this whole Tory thing popped up? Were they already having some issues? Spirit, show us. Megan the Stallion, Megan the Stallion. Kelsey, Kelsey, Kelsey. Spirit, show us the past energy that was occurring in the friendship before the actual shooting, before the actual incident. What were they? What was the energy between these two ladies? Spirit, show us. Megan the Stallion, Megan the Stallion, Megan the Stallion, Kelsey, Kelsey, Kelsey. Spirit, show us this past energy. Spirit, let us see what we need to see. The truth. Mm. Yeah. So somebody was already feeling fucked up about something. Judgment. Mm, I knew it. So, yeah, it seemed like the, the relationship from my, what I'm already seeing that there was already some um, defensive energy between the two of them and maybe some judging, too. A little bit of jealousy, Queen of Wands, Page of Pentacles, Ten of Cups, but they were friends. So, I feel like that's what that family card is about. But I feel like, you know, just from looking at this Eight of Swords, somebody was already paranoid about something between the two of them. Somebody was already feeling some type of way about something that they felt like was all something that was already happening or had already happened. So, this tells me basically before that Tory shit actually occurred, somebody was already feeling some type of way um, about it before that shit popped off. And they felt like with this three of wands that something had already happened before that happened. So I hope I'm making sense. I'm hoping y'all are following me when I say that. And especially with this seven of wands, this is all about being on, a def on the defense. And this is also speaking to me about somebody feeling higher than the other person. And there was just definitely a little bit of jealousy in the mix between the two of them. But nevertheless, um, somebody was judging too, talking a little shit to me. But Ten of Cups lets me know that this is to me, this is about family. So because they were best friends usually you call your best friend your sister so to me this is what this is speaking about mm, and i feel like you know with this page of pentacles this is sitting here for a reason somebody was probably offered an opportunity you know a new fresh opportunity to in their friendship so maybe that also was speaking you know sparking a little bit of energy between them as far as the jealousy thing goes but we're gonna see how this reading play out let's get into some specific stuff now so y'all want to know flat out did Tori sleep with Kelsey first? Spirit show us. Did Tori Lanes sleep with Kelsey first? Is that who he was actually supposed to be dating? Because they were saying that Megan, from what I was reading now, that Megan was the one creeping with Tori. And in fact, Tori was messing with Kelsey first. So let's see, Spirit. Mm. Was Tori actually... Dating Kelsey first. Mm, what's this? What's he dating her first? High Priestess. Yeah, it was kind of low-key, too. Let's, let's see. He was trying to juggle some shit, though. Mm. <laughs> that came out. 
Two of Wands, Page of Pentacles, Birdie, mm. the Star. That's Megan. Mm. The Sun. So this is speaking on several different levels to me. I don't give a damn if this lovers card is reversed because what I wanted to say. When I saw this High Priestess card, that it was on the low. And I feel like Kelsey wanted to be more known. Especially since it got, it, it's reversed. So, and then we see boundaries, you know, were violated. We see some red flags. And I don't feel like, you know, I honestly don't feel like Tori really meant for it to get this far with him and Kelsey. This is just what I'm picking up. You know, um, I feel like he always wanted to fuck with Megan. Um, and I feel like Kelsey was feeling that, especially with this Queen of Wands. There was, like I said, we just pulled some, you know, paranoia between the two of them girls. And I think this is what this is speaking on. The Nine of Wands. So, yeah, I feel like this is more talking about Kelly. I mean, I'm, I'm sorry. Not Kelly. Kelsey. She was kind of really feeling fucked up. Like, she wasn't feeling like, you know, it's kind of hard, you know, when your friend is the biggest star. And I feel like she was already in her mind about, yeah, you know, like I said, I felt like someone was already basically suspicious before this shit popped up. And I feel like that was Kelsey's energy. Felt like she always kind of felt that way. Well, at least she started to. The Ten of Wands, so burden. So burden. So I feel like he wasn't trying to talk about her as much as she wanted it to be known. Like, I'm, I'm feeling like Kelsey kind of wanted her own little, I don't want to say clout. You know what I mean? But she kind of wanted her own lane. I almost feel like that's what that Page of Pentacles was talking about, too. Three of Cups. So, yeah, I feel like this relationship was just kind of doomed from the beginning. Like, it just didn't start off well. It was about partying, having fun, getting high, fucked up, drinking. Let's see what else come up. Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, he was slow to really give Kelsey what she wanted. Paranoid. So, yeah. Restless. And yeah, it was it already won't work. And look at that five of swords reverse. Friendships. Four of pentacles, keeping something back. Somebody being nosy. Six of cups. That's their friendship. Everything is fine, but it's not because it's reversed. I feel like he was exactly seven of swords, king of cups. That's Tori, the devil. Like I said, that relationship, truth, queen of swords, death. I'm willing to change who he was. See, y'all, like I said, I feel like he was messing with her. There's a lot here. I don't even need to see no ace of wands. Because that's the, you know, y'all already know that's big dick energy there when I pull that. But I got what I, I seen what I need to see. They definitely had a relationship. That's how I'm reading that lover's reverse. It was toxic from the beginning. Maybe the intentions were wasn't where they should have been from the beginning. So let's keep going, y'all. Um, okay, so y'all kind of want to know about Jay-Z. So y'all ask, did Jay-Z tell or influence Megan in any type of way to shift the blame on Tori? Did Jay-Z influence Megan to shift any kind of um blame or bad energy towards tori did jay-z do that did jay-z tell megan or influence her energy in any kind of way when it came to tori lanes in a negative way we're gonna see how beyonce feel about megan too y'all just hold tight i got y'all did he do that did jay-z influence I feel like he did, y'all. I feel like he let her know, like, this can damage your career, sweetie. He he told her, like, I've been in this game a long time, right? And I've seen people go from the top to the bottom really, really quick. Quick, you better be careful, Ace of Cups reverse. And I feel like when I see this two of wands, this, speaking of, uh, this is speaking about bad planning. You know, even if you could say, I know bad is kind of a general statement, but when I say bad, like, shit. You know, let me put this bug in your ear. I might, You might have to lie a little bit, but look, we're going to fix this. Look, all in the phone, because this is going to mess up your career. You was just a hot girl. You was just celebrated. People going to start talking bad about you, Six of Wands reverse. You know, the public might not have your back the way they used to, depending on how you play this situation. So I'm going to need you to talk about, you know, then that's when that smoking and drinking narrative came out, which I definitely believe is true. 
we see five of wands and i feel like i see magic when i see that y'all already know how i be feeling when i be seeing people in cloaks right but we're gonna see how that plays out but he definitely warned her of her legacy and everything she uh came up with that lady this old lady is standing out to me and then i look at this five of wands yeah that's like ancestor stuff to me but um he definitely had his hand in the mix, I feel. Like, we're going to have to really, really play this situation out because your career depends on the queens of swords, law, justice, and truth. Six of swords. See, yeah, it was really painful and stressful on the bottom. The four reversed, exactly. Judgment. Then I just said that. He like the, the, the public is going to judge you harshly. And I feel like that has happened. Y'all comment down for me in the comments and let me know. Do y'all feel like, you know, this whole situation has kind of taken, taken a toll out on Megan's career? Because I feel like it has. I'm just saying. So I definitely feel like he had an influence on it. Let's see. Nine of Pentacles, King of Wands the hermit yeah i feel like he definitely did strength and i feel like that support kind of made um megan feel a little bit more confident in her and herself too because you got jay-z behind you he's been in this game for a long time he has definitely been in this game for a long time y'all so he knew exactly how to handle the situation so let's keep going so while we talking about okay before we get to miss beyonce Y'all would like to know, was the black was the bodyguard, because I didn't even know it was a bodyguard in the car, was the bodyguard that was in the car paid to keep quiet, Spirit? Did someone pay the bodyguard off to keep quiet in this situation? Did somebody pay him off? The bodyguard, Spirit. There was, in fact, a bodyguard in the car why has he been so quiet what's he paid spirit show us the truth show us the energy burden he ain't want no parts in that the world <laughs> the world that's us y'all queen of pentacles he ain't want to lose out on his job the star they go megan because he knew it was drugs involved six is, i mean i'm sorry seven of cups reverse he knew it was drugs involved and he didn't want no parts to that Everything is not fine. Reverse. Six of Cups. Oh, yeah. It was fucking him. It fucks him up at night, though. He like, damn, that was, bi that was bad timing. Nine of Wands. He knew everybody was wrong and out of control. A lot of past regret he has about the situation, too. So, the, the bodyguard is being the fool. Reverse. Exactly. The tower. See, I told y'all he didn't want to have no parts to this. Look. Ten of Swords upside down twice. And it's still not over for him. It's still not over for him at all. He's really suffering about whatever happened at night. You see for what it is. The magician. See, he didn't want no parts of that. He didn't want to talk. A, you know, when I see the mag magician, I already know that there was some manipulation in the mix. So, I feel like he was. The lovers. There they go right there, y'all. A sacrifice and a decision contemplated justice reverse i told y'all the law court legalities he didn't want nothing to do with that y'all not a source and he had to think quick too king of swords yeah you like before i let, tell a lie i'ma just be quiet two of, two of wands reverse and the page of wands so he was just like no nah. no nah. he knew what he was going up against and he ain't had a confidence <laughs> for none of that the hermit mm. don't be surprised though he might come out with something the Knight of Pentacles, but it's going to take a while. Three of Cups, like he's, because it was too much he saw, y'all. Look at these three women, three representing three people. It was too much, y'all. Three is also talking about communication is reversed. So, mouth closed, period. So, if we do hear something as far as the bodyguards, it won't be anytime soon, y'all. He got to get his story straight first because he knows what he's up against. Okay, so you guys wanted to know. Um, okay, so what is Beyonce's energy towards the situation? Mm. What is Beyonce Knows' energy spirit towards the whole situation between Megan Thee Stallion and Tory Lanez? Because somebody said they felt like Beyonce was really feeling like Megan was a burden, y'all. And that's why she put so much into someone else on her team. Hmm. What is Beyonce knows his energy towards the Tory Lane and Megan 
the stallion situation as a whole, Spirit show us. Mm, highly weird. There it go. Judgment. Mm. She's not feeling Megan, it looks like. Look, justice. See, it's just too much. Yeah. She's not feeling the situation at all. She's not feeling the situation at all. She knows that it's a bad look. And she just thinks it's too fucking much. And y'all already know, for those who are new to my channel, when I see the Hierophant, to me, um, it represents more than one thing. Especially when we're talking about Hollywood, I call that Holly weird. Um, we already know that the Hierophant traditionally means family, home, morals, values, religious you know, thing, the religious part of the family, you know, and stuff like that. So, to me, this is also represent Beyonce, you know. It really is, the Hierophant. And then this is judgment. And this is all about court. And she knows that that's not a bad look. And she's just not feeling Megan like that. And I feel like at once, at one point, she was feeling her because they both from Houston or whatever. But she was like, nah, sure, she just do too much. And she said, y'all better think about how y'all going to come out with this fast. She definitely has some inputs. <laughs> you see this lady got some input on the situation. Mm. So, y'all, she's not seeing it for her. She's not satisfied about the situation at all. And it looked like she got a little regret about something. Page of Swords, but she be watching. Look, some snake shit. New perspective, a new idea, a new a change in the routine with the dynamic between the two of them. Mm. Y'all already see the Seven of Wands. She didn't like it. She didn't like the situation. She thought it was very messy. And I feel like that Two of Cups is more so representing the relationship between Jay-Z and Megan. Not so much Megan and Beyonce. Let's see, though. Let's get down to it, Spirit. How does, how does Beyonce knows? Beyonce knows Carter. How does she feel about Megan the Stallion as a person? How does Beyonce feel about Megan the Stallion as a person? Spirit, show us. How does she feel about her as a person? How does Beyonce feel? truly feel in her heart about Megan the Stallion? Does she support her? Does she not like her? Does she feel like she's a liability spirit? Give it to us. How does she truly feel about her? Mm. The fool. <laughs> I'm so done. She feel like she's very reckless and she's a liability. Ten of Swords. Mm, six of Wands reversed again. Justice. She, is, she feel like she's a fool. And I feel like when I see this strength, this is Beyonce just trying to be her best. You know, um, she's trying her best to, you know, be cool in this situation. This is what I feel like the strength is talking about. Eight of Swords. She definitely has an opinion about Miss Megan Thee Stallion and it's strong. She feels like she wants some too, too much attention. The shirt tells you how she feels over it. The shirt says, I'm over it. Four of Cups, she's not grateful. She's not satisfied. That's how she feels about Megan Thee Stallion. She's blowing her chance. Death, and she might not change. That's just who she is. Eight of Cups. Beyonce, I feel like Beyonce wants her to, um, she actually doesn't want her on the label, but it's reversed. So that is not saying that she will be kicked off of Rock Nation, but she kind of just don't want her there. King of Pentacles, exactly. Ace of Pentacles, I told you she wasn't grateful. She really fucked up her chances. A burden. Come through, spirit. Tell us what it is. The Hermit, the Empress. This is Miss B. And it's just... The <laughs> Y'all already know the Empress energy is about love. It's about nurturing someone. It's about helping them cultivate and grow. And it's reversed. So nothing's cultivating. Nothing's grow, baby. There's no love. You know, she does not feel her like that. She honestly feels like her whole situation is just a burden, you know, on the label. It's bigger than her. Permit reversed. Yep. Mm. There it go. The tower. <laughs> there it go. She don't have nothing for Maggie at this point. Mm, two of swords some decisions have to be made and it's hard and it looks like some sacrifices there too i told y'all she she really don't want her to label six of swords this is painful she got some beyonce has some strong feelings i would tell y'all when it comes to miss megan
Okay, so y'all next question was um moving on from them. Um okay, shit. <laughs> Does Kelsey still talk to Tori? Let us know the true spirit. Does Kelsey still talk to Tori? Do she still talk to Tori at all? Is Kelsey communicating with Tori? Does Kelsey communicate with Tori on any type of level? Are they still in cahoots? Does Kelsey still? Mm. 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 <laughs> They definitely have talked with Tower Reverse. But they, they're not going to make it public. Look at that Knight of Cups. I think Tori even still tried to talk to her again, actually. Look, somebody's trying to juggle some shit. And with this Four of Swords Reverse, that's talking about someone who is not who is up. They're not re they're very restless. They still very much going through whatever they're going through. But it's the Tower Reverse. So I feel like they kind of tried to move away from that situation, the two of them. I feel like there was some type of men's made, at least an attempt. And I feel like it was Tori, even if it was spiteful. Tori was trying to talk back to her. But seven of cups. Look at this smoking and drinking. I just don't feel like their relationship was just ever based on um I just don't feel like it was just good from the beginning honestly they did a lot of partying though i'm gonna tell y'all that ten of pentacles look at these two people talking boy and girl i tell y'all to look at the images i try to teach y'all to read images and not so much of the traditional meaning that's how you become intuitive but not in pentacles but yeah i feel like they talk every once in a while he try to communicate with her but they got to be really careful look at the two of swords the world yeah they're not going nowhere it's too like i said they got to be careful because they're still in the middle of a case but they have definitely communicated look past regrets so somebody was feeling very regretful for something that they did and they tried to move past the ten of cups look at those people joining together king of pentacles but ain't shit shaking y'all they just communicating or at least have communicated before but it ain't going nowhere not like it, I don't think they're gonna pop up with a relationship on us. Um, like surprise, I don't feel that way. But y'all know these people be crazy in Hollywood, so <laughs> who knows? So the next question is, um, well, okay, shit. See, y'all be wanting to be right on. Y'all be wanting to know if it was magic dealt. <laughs> if it was any type of magic dealt or involved. Spirit, was there any type of manipulation of the energies? Was there any type of um, any type of tricks, work, spell, um, any type of magic, anything of that nature? Was there any type of spell work done in this whole situation? by anybody on anybody's end was there any type of magic or spell or done spirit show us the truth mm, look at that big ass wand king of wands so that was definitely a head in charge <laughs> four pentacles look at them two big wands knight of wands page of swords spying the lovers, there we go. Speak to us, spirit. Look, page out, page of pentacles. I told you there's some type of opportunity here. Queen of swords, some cold hearted energy too in the mix. Knight of pentacles. Mm. Work. Eight of pentacles reverse. Look at them wands, y'all. Six of swords. Mm. There we go. That's what I was looking for. Come through, Spirit. High Priestess. Seven of Wands. Look at all the wands. Is y'all peeping that? Justice. Especially when it came to the court. Somebody got some work done. Five of Cups. Look, somebody hiding their face. I look at that as magic sometimes, too. Queen of Wands. Yeah. It was. Mm, look at that. Betrayal. Look at these wands. I be telling y'all, pay attention. Queen of Cups. She is a psychic in the intuitive of the tarot page of wands come through look ancestor work six of cups page of cups mm. the star there we go judgment an angel a spirit my answer is yes what y'all think though comment down below let me know how y'all feel about this the situation because i see the i seen i said see that i seen what i need to see 
Did y'all see it too? Especially those, my gang. Y'all know how I read by now. Y'all should know how to pick up on things. So <laughs> the next question is, um, I can't wait till we get to this love reading and the shadow reading. The next question is, oh, I'm getting hot. Um, I'm going to make sure I get through all y'all questions before I get to my other decks. Okay, is Megan block balls? It seemed like I said block ball, black, <laughs> black ball by the industry. It kind of seemed like it though, don't it, y'all? I don't know. This whole story thing, it does seem like it took a hit on her career. She had just got with Rock Nation too, and she was already going through the drama with her old label. Was she ever black balls? Spirit was Megan the Stallion. Is she being black balls? by the industry in any degree is she being black and is she not see she got a strong case she got some strong support with jay-z and beyonce though i'll tell you that six of swords look mm. high priestess she got somebody working for her behind the scenes queen of pentacles it definitely reversed or so definitely did something with her money look seven of pentacles reversed this is somebody at wondering like should we still commit to this person is it worth it? Mm. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just kind of just tossing my cards all over the place. <laughs> Betrayal, heartbreak, yep. Mm. Ten of Swords, Reverse. Manifestation, Six of Cups. Mm. The Devil, the Moon. Mm. Yep, there it goes. Hollywood. Legacy, Emperor, but that's Jay-Z. Look at that tower. It definitely took a hit. Smoking and drinking. Queen of Cups. Mm-hmm. Shock surprise. Look. Mess with her coins, y'all. Sabotage. Eight of, so Eight of Swords. The Magician Reverse. Conflict. So, I would say this definitely caused some problems in her. Um, th that, that conflict, that fight she had with Tori is continuing to take a toll on her career. But see, there is some manipulation. See, somebody, I said Jay-Z and them got her back. Didn't I say that? The magician. <coughs> so, excuse me. I would say that's one good thing is that she got them to powerhouses behind her. And if anybody know PR, Beyonce do. <coughs> Miss B does. So the next question was, um, mm, what's this? The lovers. <laughs> That's funny, y'all. Spirit just talking. So I think the last question is, y'all want to know, did Kelsey try to shoot Megan? Lord, what y'all think? Before I ever pull my cards, do y'all think she did that? Do you think Kelsey actually tried to shoot Megan? You think she was in her feelings that bad would do something that stupid? Let's see. Did Kelsey do that? Did Kelsey try to shoot Megan first? There is a rumor, spirit. Show us. Is this rumor false or facts? Is this rumor false or facts, spirit? Show us. Mm. Mm, she was so jealous, y'all. Mm -mm. But there was definitely some snake shit going on. They definitely was doing a lot of drinking and smoking. Um, they definitely was already falling out, I feel, with this fate, Five of Cups reverse. And there was some definitely foolish things that happened between the two of them. But what makes me feel like that she did not and look at the justice reverse. Mm. What makes me feel like she did not is because the ace of wands reversed. That means no action was taken. But it was a lot of foolish shit that went down at night. Let me see, though. Look at that red flag. The sun. Mm-mm. Four pentacles. Look, the lovers. See how they keep coming up? Yeah, I'm not seeing what I need to see. I don't think she did, y'all. At least I'm not seeing it. We'll see how this plays out in court, but I'm not seeing that. So let's just do, ooh, Lord, look at me knocking my candle over. Oh, no. But we're going to keep doing the reading, y'all. I got y'all. That's not going to stop nothing. <laughs> okay. And my candle's still lit, so Spirit said we good. <laughs> I'm always knocking candle wax on my, on my white cloth. Anyway, let's keep it moving, y'all. So 
I'm just going to see what is the energy between Tori, Lanes, and Kelsey. Mm, what's this? No contact. Codependency. Compromise. Insecurities. I said Chelsea was jealous. Didn't I say that? And I said I, I felt like they did speak at one point, but it, it, it didn't go nowhere. Let me see. Tori Lanes, Kelsey. Tori Lanes. I'm going to still split the cards, so... So this just what fell. Tory Lane, Tory Lane, Kelsey, 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 Tory Lane, Tory Lane, Tory Lane, Tory Lane, Tory Lane, Tory Lane. Mm. Kelsey, Kelsey, Kelsey. Show us the energy between them. I want you reverse. Mm. Mirroring. Proposal. That reminds me of the Knight of Cups that came out when I say I feel like he was trying to offer her something. A new love. Immature, though. Immature. Somebody fucking with somebody new. I don't think that's about them. That's somebody else's energy. Scared. See? Look at that blood. Red. Movement. Cheating and deception. Yeah. That's why she was insecure. Game playing in cycles. Independent. Reverse. Trigger. Look at the gun. Look. Trigger. Y'all better pay attention, y'all. Cold hearted. Shadow work in the chat with fantasy and seduction, apology and sincere. Didn't I say that? I felt like it was him that tried to talk back to her, even if it was out of spite to be messy. I told y'all. Okay. So the next question is, I wanted to know, Spirit, show me the energy between... Um, show me the energy between, at that point... In the past, what was the energy between Megan the Stallion and Tory Lanez? What was the energy like between the two of them? What was the energy like between Megan the Stallion and Tory Lanez? Spirit, show me their energy. Vacation. Mm. Single parent. Lord, who's a single parent? I don't think either <laughs> any one of them got it. Does Tory have a child? A water sign. Who is the water sign? Missing you. Mm. Unconditional love. Responsibilities. Family oriented. That's crazy. Game plan. I wonder what this is about. Maybe that's picking up. Is, does Tori have children? Game plan and cycle. So they was playing games. Waiting. Look, missing you. No contact. I want you again. So look, conflict. So something was up, a spiritual lesson. It's complicated. Come through. Trigger. Look how them triggers keep coming. <laughs> Go hearted. Fantasy. Look. Changes. A break. Focused on money. Insecurities. Twin flame. Keep speaking spirit. Determined. That was Tori that was on that though. Realization. Friendship. So they definitely started as off as friends. An illusion. But things ain't, it was definitely, things ain't definitely was, I mean, things were not definitely what it looked like. Even if they played friends, it wasn't the truth in the earth, um, earth sign. And reconciliation reverse, so they are not that cool. Dating. Mm. Come through spirit, keep speaking. Dreams, obsessions, and addictions. Air sign. So, I'm going to let y'all take that <laughs> and do what y'all do with that. I'm going to let y'all do what y'all do with that. Before I conclude this reading, though, before I wrap this up, because I got one more reading I want to get out to y'all. Look at this wax, y'all. Okay. Let me just pull on some, some, some general shadow cards. Just to see the shadow energy. Spirit, show me the shadow energy between Megan Thee Stallion and Tory Lanez. Spirit, show me the shadow energy between Megan the Stallion and Tory Lanez. Megan the Stallion, Megan the Stallion, Megan the Stallion. Spirit, show us the spirit. I mean, the, <laughs> the general shadow energy between Megan the Stallion and Tory Lanez. Look at that. Stabbed in the back. Betrayed. The Tower. Mm. Eight of Pentacles reverse. They are no longer working together on any type of level. Look, they added. Look how those two people looking at each other. A decision to and a sacrifice was made. The devil. Come through, spirit. Keep speaking to us. 
Nine of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles. Look, it's chess, not checkers. Four of Swords. So they're going to be reversed. So they are going to be going back and forth for a while. The Sun. That's energy right there. Queen of Wands. A lot of jealousy. That keep popping up. Queen of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles. So they are definitely at odds. The world. They would not ever be doing anything together with the time with the with each other soon. It's a lot of cold hardness. Queen of Swords reverse. Six of Cups. Mm, look, it's a game being played. The Empress reverse. No love. Page of Swords. Some spying. Y'all see that? King of Wands. I feel like that's Tory. Ace of Pentacles. Yeah. Look over it. Look, don't that person just look too through? It's a lot between the two of them, and it's not good. Ace of Cups, but they did once fuck with each other. But see, somebody holding something back, y'all. See that person holding on to some information real tight? Y'all ain't seen nothing. Tired, deception. Somebody look. It's a game. Look at how he's sticking out his tongue. The hangman. A message. Let me see. Two of Wands. Some type of planet. Hmm. Deception, y'all. Seven of Swords. Look at this. I'm sorry. I called this a Seven of Swords. Actually, this is the um, Five of Swords. So this is talking about their conflict and a fight. And this is the deception. Sneakiness and lying. Hmm. So I'm going to let y'all take this and do what it do. And I want to know how y'all felt about this reading. Um, did y'all pick up on anything? I be telling y'all all the time to... Pay attention to the images, not so much to the words. Pay attention to how you feel it in the moment you see it and don't second guess yourself. Let me know down in the comments, y'all. I got to clean off this candle, this candle wax. I'm going to try to before I start the next reading for y'all. I love y'all so much. Um, like I said, you can definitely hit me up at www magicalflowerstarot.com or you can email me at magicalflowerstarot at yahoo.com I love y'all so much and I got y'all. Stay tuned.